Today we're looking at the Vigor 5000 milliamp mini sized power bank. If you travel or you're a student and are using an Apple device, this little power bank will sort all your issues out. So you're saying to yourself, what issue do I have with a power bank? Well, let me explain. This power bank resolves the issue of tangly cables as this has a lightning connector built into the power bank so you don't need any cables to charge your device. So when Vigor reached out and asked, do I want to share this product with you guys? My answer was yes, straight away. They have also sent me other power banks. Make sure you subscribe and turn the notifications on so you'll be notified as soon as I upload them videos. Okay, let's take a closer look. So I have three power banks here, which are exactly the same. The only difference is the color. So here is the blue color, that's the black and that's the white. Before we start, remember if you find the video useful, leave a like. I should also mention, make sure to check out Vigor's social media accounts as they have regular giveaways and as the saying goes, you have to be in it to win it. I will leave all links in the description box below. So without further ado, let's begin. Now let's take a look around the box. So as you can see, there's a power bank, Vigor 5000 milliamp 20 watt PD output. On the back here is just some more information. So now let's have a look inside the box. So this is everything that comes inside the box. We have the power bank, an extra cap for the lightning connector end. We have a welcome guide which comes in different languages. We have a USB A to USB type C charger as well. So now let's have a look around the power bank. So on the front here, as you can see, it has light indicators here. On the side, this would be your wake up button or start button, whichever one you want to call it. On the top here, we have our lightning connector, which will connect into our Apple device. It also comes with a cap. And on this side, we have the USB-C input port. So now let me show you how you would use the power bank. So what you want to do on the side here is press the wake up button. As you can see the charging indicators have come on, or the light indicators. Take this top off, grab your device, your Apple device, and plug it in. And as you can see, it is charging. Let me show you this. There you go. Then you just set it down. So let's talk about the power bank a bit more. This power bank is only compatible with Apple devices. It is designed for all iPhones and AirPods. I'm talking about the one I'm using right now. I do know they do have a Samsung version in their website. The lightning output on this power bank is 20 watts. So it will give full 20 watts when plugged in. It can charge an iPhone 13 to 60% in 30 minutes. And also it can charge your AirPods four times before the power bank needs recharging. One thing I noticed about this power bank is it does take a while to charge your device. When the power bank needs recharging, it will take roughly one and a half hours to recharge before use. I really do like this power bank, not only for its main attribute, but because of the size and weight. It is nice and small, so it's suitable for any occasion and situation. It is nice and light too, weighing in at 92 grams or 3.25 ounces, which is just slightly heavier than an egg. There you go, my friends. That was the Vigor 5000 milliamp mini-sized power bank. Thank you for watching, and I will see you in the next video.